Hello and welcome to the summer vacation edition of Mead Week. I'm Brian Spann. We're more than halfway through the summer and I'm taking the opportunity to take a few days off, but I do have some important reminders for you before I go. First, we mentioned this several times. The U.S. Army Field Band and Soldiers Course, based right here at Fort Meade, is set to kick off its annual summer concert series Saturday, August 1st. The series continues each Saturday through the 22nd. This week, the Jazz Ambassadors perform a tribute to jazz legend Billie Holiday. On August 8th, the Concert Band and Soldiers Chorus go to the movies. And on August 15th, the volunteers perform a selection of America's road music. And on the 22nd, it's the finale with the Concert Band and Soldiers Chorus. They'll be joined by the Continental Color Guard and the Presidential Salute Battery for Tchaikovsky's 1812 Overture. Elsewhere, the Bowie Bay Sox, a Baltimore Oriole farm team, are hosting a Military Heroes Appreciation Night Friday, July 31st. The first thousand fans 18 and older will receive a 21 card set of baseball cards depicting local members of the community nominated by families and friends. Game time is 7 p.m. For ticket information, go to www.baysox.com. Meanwhile, signups for Vacation Bible School continue through Friday, July 31st. Vacation Bible School runs August 3rd through the 7th from 9 to noon at the Chapel Center. Registration is limited to the first 165 children ages 4 years old through 5th grade. Register today at either the main post chapel or the chapel center. In other news, one of Fort Meade's largest community events of the year is coming up on August 4th. National Night Out is an annual community building campaign that promotes police and emergency services partnerships with the local community. Communities across the country will host block parties, festivals, parades, and other events. Fort Meade hosts what has been an award-winning program several years running. There's a parade through the housing area at 5 p.m. with the main event taking place on McLaughlin Parade Field from 6 to 9. Fort Meade Police and Emergency Services personnel along with units from the surrounding community are participating. Once again, National Night Out is August 4th from 6 to 9 p.m. And finally on our Midsummer Report, Army Community Service is celebrating its 50th anniversary this week. For everyone at Meade TV and the Fort Meade Public Affairs Office, I'd like to wish ACS a happy 50th birthday. I'm Brian Spann. Hope you have a great Meade week. On this great day, I want to wish Army Community Service a happy 50th birthday. Thank you for caring for the men, women, and families who live and work on this installation and who do so much every day to keep our nation safe. Happy birthday, ACS. Happy birthday, ACS. On July 25, 1965, Army Chief of Staff General Harold Johnson announced the establishment of Army Community Service. By 1969, 155 ACS centers had been established Army-wide, including Fort Meade. In 1995, an official mission statement was established for Army Community Service. The mission of ACS is to facilitate commanders' ability to provide comprehensive, coordinated, and responsive services that support readiness of soldiers, civilian employees, and their families. Today at Fort Meade, on an average day, ACS provides assistance to approximately 102 people every hour, or 1.7 every minute. Happy birthday, ACS! Fort Meade's ACS Center offers all 12 ACS core programs in the areas of education, advocacy, and support. Happy birthday, ACS! This year, we are proud to celebrate Army Community Service's 50th birthday. It has been a pleasure for me and the entire ACS team to serve the Fort Meade community. Although we have Army in our title, we serve all branches, all services, our civilians, retirees, everyone in the community. Happy birthday, ACS. We look forward to continuing to adapting our services and programs to best meet your needs. Happy birthday, ACS. They do so much for us. That's why we do so much for them. USO Metro's programs boost the morale of our military members and their families. Located right here in the Washington, Baltimore region are the largest USO centers in the world. The USO Warrior and Family Centers at Fort Belvoir and Bethesda. These state-of-the-art centers provide services to lift the spirits of our troops and their families and offer robust programs for the wounded, ill, and their caregivers. USO Metro Centers and Airport Lounges provide a strong sense of community, familiarity, and trust by providing a home away from home. USO Metro is proud to serve those who serve and their families in Maryland, Northern Virginia, and Washington, D.C.